Hello everybody, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my first ever YouTube video. Uh, if you don't already know me, I am Niall Kirkland. I have been posting healthy, kind of gym-friendly recipes on my Instagram for about the last year. So you can expect to see lots of healthy recipes on this YouTube channel as well as maybe some more fitnessy workout type videos and maybe even some kind of lifestyle vlogs. Uh, today we're going to be making some high protein Oreo brownies. Some of you may have seen these on my Instagram page. I think I posted it about over a year ago now. Yeah, these are a really, really good healthy alternative. They're high protein, super simple to make, and they just taste delicious. So yeah, we've got the whole setup. Got a light here. We've got a camera off to the side here so we can get some nice close-up shots of the food. Uh, we are going to be learning as we go along, so bear with me. But fingers crossed, I think that edit should come out really good. Um, so yeah, let's let's make some brownies. Cool. So just add the mashed bananas to your mixing bowl. Next, I'd add the peanut butter in. Then we're gonna give that a good old stir. Now is a good time to preheat your oven. So we need 200 degrees. I think that's 400 Fahrenheit. Don't quote me on that. Next up is the protein. I am a my protein athlete. If you need to get some good protein, head on over to myprotein.com. Use Nile 30 and you will get a nice discount. Uh, I'm using vanilla flavor. You could equally use chocolate or salted caramel, something like that. We're using two scoops of the vanilla protein, cocoa powder, and give that a good old mix in. As you mix this in, you'll notice that it starts to resemble something that actually looks really like brownie batter. It starts smelling really chocolatey and good. Now we're going to add our Oreos. So we're just doing four for now. So just crumble them up, nice large chunks, and add them in to the mixture. You don't want to mix the Oreos in too much so they start disintegrating and kind of losing their shape. Cool. So that's looking and tasting really good. Next, we just need to get our baking tray. I will let you know what size this baking tray is in the description. So what I do is just get a little bit of butter, put it on my fingers, rub it on the baking tray. That way the baking paper sticks nicely. Then we transfer that mixture into the baking tray. Using our spatula, just lightly press it down. Make sure it's nice and even, reaching all the corners of the baking dish. Lovely jubbly. So I think that's pretty much ready to go in the oven. So we're gonna put it in for 10 minutes. And then after 10 minutes, we're gonna take it out. We're gonna break some more Oreos up into quite large pieces, decorate the top of the brownies, and then put it back in for another five minutes. So yeah, let's pop it in the oven. Hello. Oh, I'm trying to get you in focus, but I can't. Welcome to Niles. YouTube channel, who's excited? <laughs> Give us a comment. Woohoo! So the 10 minutes is up and we're just going to decorate the brownies with the Oreos now. Just gently press them into the top of the mixture. And then they're gonna go back in the oven for about another four or five minutes. The brownies are finally ready. So I'm just going to leave them to cool for like 10 minutes or so. I think I'm going to cut them into 10, 10 slices, 10 bites. And as I said before, I will include all the macros in the description box below. Right, so the Oreos are all done. I've cut them into 10 pieces. These have actually come out really, really good. They're kind of got a bit of a crunch on the outside and they're kind of super soft and gooey on the inside. I think it is time now. For a little taste test. My trusty, trusted, trusty. I'm the taste test the woman that lives in this house and eats all the good stuff. So basically I cook a lot of food and uh, Megan eats a lot of food. Sorry. It is a family favourite. It's a Kirkland household oh, favourite. that goo. Yeah, and then we get a focus, get a on, focus that. on the goo. Yeah, you can see. They're so good. These are good ones. I had two last night, so. If you made it this far to the end of the video, Thank you for watching. <laughs> Keep an eye out for many more YouTube videos. As I said before, I want to do predominantly food stuff. 
but also be able to include some of um, some like insight into like my training as well, which I don't really do on Instagram, as well as like lifestyle. So you might even see a few vlogs from I time think. to time. I won't be around. Showing off my beautiful family. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought I was going to say beautiful wife. But what? What? If you do them, and also comment below what recipes Niall should make, because I want I want to try them. Okay. So if you have any like requests, yeah, let us know. Let Niall know, and I'll eat them. Yeah. Let me know what kind of food stuff you want me to try in the future, as well as like other types of videos, um, and that'll be really good. Thank you very much for watching. Bye. Good.